Hello and welcome to my gameplay of Fallout Shelter. Now this game was just released on the Nintendo Switch. I barely only heard about it because of their E3 announcement. And I decided to pick it up because it's kind of my introduction to the Fallout series. I never played any of the other Fallout games. I know that people are excited about the Fallout 76 announcement. And so I'm going to check this out. See if, if I enjoy it. It seems to be kind of like a community building game. I'm not really sure you, you can build a community in, in a certain shelter under the ground. Uh, so I know it's nothing near what the original Fallout games are like. But I'm going to check it out. I'm going to see if I have fun and maybe I'll play Fallout in the future. Anyway, let's get into this. Choose an ID. Uh, I will choose something and you will see later. Okay, congratulations. Vault Tech has selected you to be the Overseer Vault 409. Oh, I guess the, the number didn't need to be hidden. Oh, the vault keeps people safe from the dangers of the wasteland. As Overseer, your job is to expand and maintain the vault while keeping your dwellers safe and happy. Each room has a special attribute it uses. Assign dwellers with the best special to make them happy and produce extra resources. Vault Tech will give you a daily rating based on your performance. Remember to keep your dwellers happy and do a great job. Please stand by. Helpful hint, welcome to your new vault, Overseer. Let's introduce you to the basic concepts. Let's build a room, okay. Uh, sign dwellers to produce power. Power generator builds power, okay. Easy enough, got some strength, got some stuff. Build, build zones where you can build rooms. Use the left stick to select a build zone. All right, that did it automatically, but okay. Now we need dwellers to make the power gener generator produce power. Yes, we do. New dwellers have shown up at the vault door. Ooh. You can see the Dweller's special stats. This tells you where they can be used most effectively. So Nicholas Mills, uh, he has a shirt and he has fists apparently, but no dog, which means he shouldn't, he shouldn't join because he doesn't have a dog, but we'll, we'll let him join. He probably has some other useful thing. Uh, hold A to grab them and select a room. Try assigning the Dweller to the power generator. Woohoo! Ragdoll! So I can move him over to. Oh, moves a little way too quickly. Move him over here. S5. I can't see what the thing says. How do I. How do I turn off the thing? What can I do here? Well, he, he walked in, so that's, that's good at least. He's doing something. I can see his information again. Can I get rid of this helpful hint? Get rid of the hint! Por favor! I don't know what to do. Assign the second dweller. I hate how it covers that bottom part though. Okay, there we go. So that just gives kind of general stats. Uh, can't really see what else is there, but we have 10 S, 10 volts, three minutes, 23 seconds. That's a timer for something or other. And I can rush it. I can rush energy production. So if I can just manage to do that, then 24 seven, then my out energy output is, is fully fully upgraded. Now that they're working, they'll produce resources. Hold ZR to zoom in. Zoop. I'm trying. I have the perfect work assignment. Thanks, Overseer. All right. I am zoomed in. Veronica and Nicholas. I'm zoomed in. What else can I do? Yes. Yes, I held ZR.
I can zoom out with ZL. If you're in dire need of extra resources, you can rush by pressing up. Ooh, activate! Ooh, we've completely completed our rush and collected caps. Let's build a second room. Ooh, we can build a diner. I can make food. Uh, I will build it right next to the power room. Or right across from the power room. Because you're going to need to eat food when you're doing power stuff. Water treatment. Produce water. Water is just kind of slightly maybe important. I don't know. Is it a basic need for human beings? I'm not entirely sure. Great work. Here's some food and water to start your vault. Press the left stick to display your vault meter details and keep track of your resources and needs. More dwellers are here! Yay! Our community is growing. Now that you know the basic rules of the Overseer role, keep expanding your vault. Just remember to keep your dwellers alive and happy. Good luck! So we've got Nancy Stewart, Mildred Lane, Christian Hill, Donna Davis, and Tammy Perry. We've got whole oodles of people here. Um, hold on, let's... Does it tell us what their specialties are? Not particularly. So let's just drag you. Let's put you into the kitchen. Because, yes. Four women. Ooh! Emergency! Emergency! Controls! Controls! Use the left stick to select a room. After selecting room, press A or use the left stick to cycle through the dwellers. Use the right stick to move the camera and ZL and ZR to zoom in and out. Okay, you've taught me this before. Donna, I will put you in water treatment, I guess. We've got two people on energy. There are no longer any rats in the diner. That's good. Don't want rats in the diner. Uh, Christian Hill, you all just have shirts. Uh, you can send dwellers to explore the wasteland. Assign a dweller outside of the vault and give them supplies to start their adventure. Cool. Uh, let's send Nan. Can I send Nancy outside of the vault? Is is that what I do? Living quarters, power generator, diner. Dwellers with a high luck special are more successful at rushing rooms and getting caps bonuses. Okay. Tammy, water treatment. Uh, those don't give me a signal for how many people I can put in, so I'll just probably just put in as many as I can. Let's put someone else in water, because water treatment is very important. And Christian, I'll put you... Uh, I think I'll also put you in the power room, because that's pretty important. Oh, assign two dwellers to the right room. I guess I did something right. Does it tell me, like, minus, can I see the people? It doesn't tell me what special they are, though. It gives bars for their specialties, but... Oh wait, she's on coffee break? That's coffee break? Upgrade your production rooms to produce more resources. Well, I definitely should in Well, I guess... Am I stuck on power? I should definitely increase power, because that's always important. I could destroy it! Uh, upgrade for 250 caps. Production storage upgraded. Sweet. Oh, she's up... Oh, she's on break from whatever she's doing, so... She's working in the diner. You... Oh! Hello, Nicholas Hancock. I don't know what you do well. Let's put you in water. That's important. Use the last available space. Build more living quarters to accommodate more dwellers. Okay. So... That means I have to build stuff, right? Uh... I don't have enough caps. I'm really low on caps. Oh, I just col so I can collect whatever they make using that. Okay, I'm slowly getting the hang of this. Um, I could upgrade, except I don't have enough caps. The diner is here. 
I don't know what you do. You're at 50% happiness. Nancy, I think I'll move you into the diner. Oh, two dwellers to the right room. Merged rooms can hold more dwellers so they produce more resources. Cool. I didn't... Oh, cool. I got a little bonus of, of caps. So, what, what's this? Oh. Uh, claim that. So this, this get has a lot of... Um, it's very similar. Nintendo also released Pokemon Quest recently, which if you saw my, my video, you know, it's also slotted for mobile release. Can I, can I put you outside somewhere in the wasteland? Well, it buzzed, so I take that as a no. Can I put you somewhere? Build more living quarters. I don't. I can't build any more living quarters though. I only. I need 130. Destroy rocks to expand your vault deeper. With what caps, sir? With what caps? Level. Did someone level up? Ooh. Cool. I don't know what happened there, but whatever it was, it worked. I still don't have enough caps though. Um, are these people supposed to produce water for me? Oh, in another minute. And these guys in another minute too. So that means we're just kind of waiting here. Can I rush? I rush this incident fire, 35%. So that means there's a 35% chance of fire? In my water area? Let's do it. Success! Aha, I can build! I can build! You, I just earned a lunchbox, apparently. Select the lunchbox icon on the Pip-Boy to open your lunch... Oh, okay. I don't know what... What that means. Uh, let's build another living quarters. Exactly next to the last one. Oh, I expand it. Okay. So now you can come in. Uh, we're like it said to put you into the wasteland, but what does that even mean? Um, let's just see where you fit in. S, you go here. I can collect this in, in any case. We're using up a lot of energy, which is kind of expected. You guys are kind of just working. You got to level up. What else can you do? What does leveling up give me? And now we've got Jeremy Fisher here. Again, I can't figure out what these specials are. We just got to grab him and and Oh, steady supply of power, food and water. If you run low, the bars will turn red. Uh, rooms will start shutting down, dwellers will lose health, they become irritated. So basically resource management. S A P uh I don't know what plus one. Is he going to the right place? I can't tell. Need more dwellers for your vault, try assigning dwellers to the living quarters and see if magic happens. Okay. Uh let's Let's assign you, Donna Davis. Male and female dwellers within the living quarters have a chance of making babies. We can repopulate our shelter. Except we need a, a man to go in there with her. Who do I want to drag away? I shouldn't drag away anyone from water. So let's, let's take you, I guess. I don't know. I still can't tell what any of your, your powers are, but they'll have a chance of making babies. I don't know what that chance is, but we're just going to watch and find out eventually. And that, I guess, seems to be pretty much everything I can do at the moment. Uh, this is very much a waiting game. Objectives, these kind of refresh. Very much a waiting game. It seems like it would fit very well on mobile. So, I guess... Since I can't build anything else, 
Uh, oh, lunchbox. I can open the lunchbox. What do you give? Get some cards. Again, rifle. Ooh. Guess that'll help when I got in the wasteland. Got some junk. Ooh, caps! So I can build stuff. Extra food. Perfect. Rare card! Red rocket. I could unlock some stuff there. In the shop! Paid DLC. Definitely... <laughs> definitely very mobile-like. So, I think that's pretty much everything we can do here. Uh, Overseer's office to see a quest list. Uh, you can manage in all the weapons and outfits you own. To what end? Well, I could sell it or recycle it, I guess. Uh, not sure what. We can two or three, three, merge them. Uh, let's see, get you your level up. How much time is left on this room? 11 seconds? That's fine. Get more water, that's fine. Uh, it looks like up here they're kind of chatting it up. Come back. You got Christian and, and what's your face? Donna. Christian and Donna chatting it up. They're going to make a baby eventually. I can feel it. Collect this water treatment. Nobody. Oh, someone else is coming here. Emma Bishop, what can you do? I can't tell what you can do. I guess those bars mean something, but the... It doesn't really give me much guidance on these numbers here. I am again running low on water, so I guess I'll rush this again. 43% chance of... of... Uh, that's not good. I think I'll need to build another water treatment plant. Give us more water. Keep us topped off. You get a level up. You get a level up. Everybody gets a level up. And... Let's see... 397 more caps. I guess I can build some more stuff. Uh, storage room requires one. More dwellers are needed. Uh, let's give some more water. Since that's always necessary. Uh, I can build you here, just expand you. Get some more water, get some more food. We are fully topped out on that. We are still good on power and our water is kind of not looking good, I guess. But I guess we could rush it eventually. What can I upgrade this? Not enough, not enough caps, unfortunately. We are sitting above the level though, so Let's add one more diner, just so we have some extra stuff. Most important resource is power. That That is very true. So I will build another power. Oh, I'm out of coins. I need three more, three more caps. I may have screwed up, <laughs> but I think this will be all for, for Fallout gameplay. Uh, Fallout Shelter, it looks very minimalistic right now. I don't know how far this game is going to go, how in-depth you can get. Uh, and as far as the gameplay I've seen so far, it just kind of seems like a standard resource management game. Uh, I'm sure it has nothing to do with the original Fallout games besides the, the aesthetics and all that. So that'll be it for me with Fallout Shelter. Let me know what you think about the game. Do you like it? Are you going to be playing it more? Do you think I should continue playing it and see what else I can do? Uh, see what else the game has to offer. Uh, I'll probably check it out every day just to like keep it up, see what else I can open up. But I don't think I'll be playing this very, very often. It is free to download for, for the Nintendo Switch. So check it out if you enjoyed the Fallout games or enjoy these kinds of community building games. But that'll be all for me. My name is Tofu. Leave a like if you enjoyed. I will see you in the next video.